Well, I think today, the biggest advantage of Formula E is that there is only one category where of electric racing cars. If you want to be part of the game, you have to join Formula E. It's not like with normal combustion engine, you can do rally, you can do Formula One, you can do endurance racing. Here you have only Formula E. So if you want to showcase your technology, you have to join. And, and actually it's really good because it, it makes it a very tough and good championship. We need to further improve everything and when I see the trend of improvement it's uh, making me very confident that we're going to achieve it because you know we need to to improve um, the capacity of the of the batteries we need to make them lighter we need to make them better and then of course at some point we need to focus in making sure we can produce this electricity and energy but I'm very confident that in the next 10 years we're going to see a big shift, you know, of people going to electric cars just because they, they're going to become much better than the normal cars. It's just now a matter of time, really. It's not a question anymore. Cities like Zurich, Paris, they are pushing very much for electric mobility. Not only electric cars, you know, uh, push bike, wh whatever. And uh, those big countries we have in Europe are the first ones now, and it's, it's going to follow up. The technology needs to further improve, just to make sure you will not ask yourself anymore between a normal combustion car and electric car. You know, before it was more trend because uh, combustion cars were much better. Where now it's starting to be the opposite. So. When you know there is something better, why don't buy it? And at some point, it's not going to be a question anymore whether you, you, you buy it or not. So I would say the technology needs to further improve.